What's up, guys? Best Games here. Hello. And I have another gameplay commentary for you guys on Warhawk. <clears throat> this time, I am not dropping a chem strike, yeah, there but three guys on I got a helo pilot. And you know what? As a teaser, I'm actually going to have you guys predict something. And you don't have to put it in yeah, the comments, but it's up to you. Do you think I break 50 kills this game? Because the answer, well, you'll just have to watch and find out. So, we're playing some Domination on Warhawk. And I was just playing with uh, Chaos here. And my, my picture screen is a little uh, weird, but whatever. Anyway, the purpose of my commentary today is Twitch. Now, if you guys were here for my last commentary, that wasn't about the wolf skin that uh, I put up before everybody else and only got a hundred something views out of. Um, and no, I'm not salty. Just uh, get over it. Anyway, so Twitch, yeah. Um. Mm. So I can officially say that my account, Best at Games, is my official live streaming Look out, dog behind you. Um, account for Twitch, uh, not just on TV, for game. Twitch. Dog and now, the dog now this is over a week ago at this point, but um, it it was a challenge. Let's let's put it this way: it was a challenge to get what I wanted. Because the staff over at Twitch was not so kind to my request, and I mean, even with Twitch draw, I mean, it was just a problem all the way around. I had to basically point out the fact that they were treating me like scum, and that they couldn't that they were telling me complete and utter lies and yes, no. I, I had to basically disprove everything that they said for them to just switch over the account which like I said in my rant oh, and you, you know it, it could you. take probably all of two seconds Hi. to switch that over so after some some discussion back and forth let's go with discussion it sounds not rude um, after some discussion back and forth, we ended up, I basically, uh, he was like, oh, well, you know, we, we don't do it since October 31st. Meanwhile, earlier in the email, he told me December, and then he also told me March, which, I mean, I at that point, you're just, you're just lying to me. You're just making up fucking numbers. And maybe they're not made up. Maybe that's when they actually, in theory, stopped doing it, and then they started doing it again. Because I found Wait, proof you, on the forums that they were doing it after March of of this year. So I was like, oh, okay, what the fuck? And then they started saying, oh, October 31st. And it's like, oh, well, you know what? That's bullshit because that's not what you told me the first time. Because it was after October 31st that you stopped. And then I even contacted you. This was in November. You could have told me, oh, in October we stopped doing it. Oh, I'm so sorry. We can't help you. If you told me that, I would have been a hundred percent okay with it. If you fed me lies, though, that's when I stopped being okay with it. So it took a little while, and then basically in one of my emails back, I'm like, okay, well, I need to speak to the CEO of Twitch because at this point, you guys are just bullshitting me, and I'm telling you what I want, and it's not that hard, and I know you can do it, so just do it. So they come back at me with some bullshit thing saying, oh, like, the the, the guy, the, the CEO of Twitch, he was in the meeting that decided that we were going to stop doing this, so so even talking to him won't, won't do anything. It's like, okay, well then give me his email. So instead of giving me his email, he comes back at me saying, oh, well, looking into your account to uh, to, to switch it over, um, we, we noticed an odd history, and... 
and and we just need to verify when where you made the account because we can't we can't switch over accounts that we think have been yeah, sold okay. or traded. I'm just like, okay, what? So now you're looking in my account instead of giving me the CEO's email, for one. For two, that means you can do it and you've just been an asshole to me this entire fucking time. And three, you're coming up with some bullshit excuse as to why you shouldn't do it. So, just, just putting that all aside, I'm like, okay. I started my account. I'm not saying I'm not saying names or names of towns, but in New York I started my account because this I've only lived in New York my entire life. I've never lived anywhere else. I have lived in the state of New York on the island of Long Island for my entirety of my life. I have almost never left this island for anything except for some trips through school and other things like that. So, Basically, I, do it. I know where I made my account. Yeah, no, it's one of two towns, so I named those two towns. And after a couple seconds, he got back to me. Well, I went to work, and then after I looked back at home, he was like, Oh, well, we, we found that the account was stored in New Jersey, but, but, but we switched it over anyways. I'm just like, okay, this sounds like bullshit to me, but you switched the account. So, my only response back was, thank you very much, that wasn't very hard. So, as a person who works retail and has to deal with the general public every fucking day of my life, I can tell you that people get really nasty when they can't get things that they And, especially when... People aren't doing things that they know that they can do for them without a problem. So, my real point is, is that, I mean, if you know you can do it, but you're not gonna do it, don't lie to them. Or if you lie to them, make it a solid fucking lie. Make it so that way there is no chance of disproving that lie. Because if there's a chance of disproving that lie... Oh, here's the mortar fire. Let's go. Um, then you're fucking stupid. Like, if they just came out and told me, Oh, hey, we don't switch over accounts since October 31st. Nope. I'm sorry, we can't help you. If that was what was in the first response to me, I would have said, Well, that's stupid. Is there any way that you could do it anyways? And if I got a response saying no, I would have been like, okay, fine, I'll just make a new account. Literally, that would have been the entire conversation. Sure, would I still be pissed at them? Yes, I would. But at least I wouldn't have been force-fed lies. So, my main point is, don't fucking lie to your customers. Don't lie to other people that... Oh, you're man, expecting I, money or some sort of reimbursement or payment from because right like I could spend money at Twitch I could buy subscriptions to other things and apparently that is a caveat of sorts because if you spend money on Justin TV and you want to have your account switched over to Twitch they absolutely have the ability to do it and they will do it for you which just tells me that A. you have the ability to fucking do it so, what the hell? I don't know. I, I just don't. I don't want to hear bullshit. I don't want to hear fun. crap about it. I don't want to hear, oh, we can't do this because blah 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 blah. I don't care. Just do it for me. I know you can. And, I mean, it's not that game breaking. It's not gonna, you know, cause the world to fucking erupt. It's not gonna break your fucking bank. It's not going to be scamming you out of money. Well, the ones that are. Now, the shit that I have to deal with in retail at customer service desks, <laughs> the customer service desk, desk that I work at, um, yeah, people scam people out of money all the time. And I can't, I'm not going to say how, I'm not going to say how it works, because that's just bad for my job and my business. Well, business that I work for. But it's... It's ridiculous. 
It's ridiculous. And I know if I could do that for someone, I can go through all that trouble. They can fucking just switch my account over from Justin TV to fucking Twitch. That's that's the bottom line. So, anyway, the bottom line now is my Twitch stream will be in the link of every description from here on out for you guys to you know go watch I will try to put up a video every time that I'm streaming however if you really want to know when I'm streaming follow me on Twitter the Twitter name is at best games just like my YouTube just like my twitch everything's getting unified in some way or another so if you just remember best of games and you type it into Google the first result that you get from best of games is this channel just to let you know and then anything after that is basically anything else that I've been involved with except for a few random random things like here and there they're so random though that you would you wouldn't even know Fuck you. so follow me on twitch follow me on uh, Damn, Twitter I don't have a Facebook for you guys to look at because that's my prop. That's that's me. That's my personal uh, business, and you know that's all about me. So anyway, this game has come to a close. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. If you are new, hit that subscribe button, and I will catch you guys on the next video. Peace.